happen. We live in a day and age where we're able to click on links when we buy a ticket and look at things like contract of carriage. What does the airline say about how they're going to protect your privacy if they are? Now, of course, you can't have cameras in bathrooms. Right. If there's any reason why you would, you would need to notify the passenger. But let's step back from that and think about what m many of us, most of us do on flights. Like you said, you get up. You, you use in-flight entertainment. Where do you go? What do you watch? You use the internet. What do you do when you're on the internet? You give up some of your privacy when you choose to avail right. yourself mm -hmm. of some of these services. How much? Take a look at all the information that airlines already provide about what they do or what they might be doing with their with your information because it's right there. Nobody reads it, nobody clicks on of it. Of course. But it's available for you to read if you care about it's that. It's like this much fine print. Oh, it's way more I just than that. Oh, it goes on, on and on and on. I'm not gonna look through all that stuff. Well, and that's what most passengers say, which is why they don't know as much about passenger yeah. privacy as they could.